Hi, I'm Dr. Robin Steely, and this is Oral Fitness for Life. There is a term that is thrown around by dentists and patients alike called TMJ. It is used to describe various symptoms, including pain and noise in your jaw joints. Pain and noise, such as clicks and pops, can masquerade many other problems, such as sinus issues, headaches, migraines, neck, shoulder pain, and stiffness, earaches, and tooth problems. The term TMJ really refers to the jaw joints that are on each side of our heads. These joints are unique in that they allow us to hinge open as well as slide forward to open even wider. As seen in this illustration, the jaw joint or ball of the joint sits in a socket. Between the ball and the socket is a disc or pad. All of this mechanism is controlled by muscles that allow you to move in an infinite number of directions. You can move up and down, side to side, and forward and back. Each jaw joint functions independently and is different from any other joint in the body. Symptoms of changes in the jaw joints may include muscle pain, headaches, and noise, pops or clicks. 85% of all pain in these joints is related to muscles. These small, little muscles that control the movement of the joint can be overworked or fatigued until they become painful. Most of the time, the cause of this muscle pain is an unstable chewing system. An unstable chewing system is the result of forces put on the teeth in a way that they are unable to recover from that pressure. The human body can put up to 900 pounds per square inch of force on their teeth. The teeth are designed to withstand that amount of force as long as the force is straight up and down on the teeth. If there is an imbalance in the system, this kind of pressure can create all kinds of damage. Typically, one of two things can happen. One, people grind their teeth and begin to wear them down. Once they've gone through the enamel or outer layer of the tooth, the inner layers or dentin will wear seven times faster. As the teeth are worn down, the face gets shorter and the teeth may get more sensitive. This can lead to damage of the nerves inside the teeth, fractures of the roots or the tops of the teeth, and an increase in gum recession around the mouth. Number two, with an unstable chewing system, people may use the face muscles to try to get their teeth together so they can eat and function properly. They literally pull the jaws forward to get the teeth to touch properly, pulling the jaw joint out of the socket. In either of these instances, the symptoms that you might experience would be tooth wear and muscle pain. These muscles are being overworked and overexercised. Because they are very small, fine fibers, it is easy for them to get tender and painful. When this occurs over a period of time without any intervention, changes can occur in the joints. These changes will, over time, progress to an arthritic condition and degenerative joint disease. The diagnosis of TMJ involves a thorough review of your story from when the disorder first started. A physical exam will help to separate the various parts of the diagnosis into smaller pieces that can be more easily managed. Once a proper diagnosis is made, the first step is to put out the fires, relieve the pain and tenderness, and stabilize the jaw joints completely in their sockets. This is most often done with a bite splint or orthotic. The orthotic is worn 24-7 for a short period of time to allow the joint to stabilize and begin to heal. Once that occurs, we can then begin to understand what you do with your teeth and how the entire chewing system is working. If it is indeed muscle pain, most of that pain will go away within the first week or so. Once the proper diagnosis is made, permanent corrective action can be taken to undo the damage and recreate what was originally intended to function well and be pain-free. The Oral Fitness for Life approach to dentistry includes this area of an unstable chewing system. I've spent most of my career studying and learning how the chewing system works. As I've followed this road less traveled, I discovered in my own mouth the challenges that existed and took steps to correct that. By wearing the orthotic and having my own mouth rebuilt in a minimally invasive manner, I was able to eliminate muscle pain and grinding teeth. My mouth functions better than it ever has and is totally pain-free. Our only goal is to help you make the best decisions that are in your own best self-interest. I'm Dr. Robin Steely. 
and I want you to have Oral Fitness for Life. <laughs>